if I had no clue what good restaurants were in my area, I would hit up a Taurus. In today's video, we're going to go more in depth in my newly added Zodiac series where I touch base with each Zodiac sign from January to December and discover traits about each sign from when they're born each year to career paths that they're most likely going to gravitate towards. And today we're going to stay grounded with our Taurus brothers and sisters. Good morning, evening, or afternoon, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. And if you haven't seen my face before, hi. My name is Kanoi, and I make videos on business, spirituality, and lifestyle tips to help you learn, earn, and grow. If you're interested in this kind of content, don't forget to follow me on my socials right here. Go ahead and hit the like button for YouTube's algorithm, as well as subscribe and hit the post notification so you won't miss any future uploads from me. Before we get started, here's today's shout out. And if you want more information on how to get a shout out in my next video, go ahead and stay tuned to the end of this video. Taurus, Taurus. So a Taurus is born between April 20th and May 20th. Their element is going to be a fixed earth sign. And the planet ruling is of course, none other than Venus, which represents love and daydreams and all drug-like hallucinogenic feelings of positivity. So the fixed element of our Taurus makes them extremely grounded. And a lot of the decisions that they make in their life are usually mainly based off of self-fulfillment. If it is something that a Taurus wants to do, whether somebody disagrees or not, they will do it. And being ruled by Venus along with the Libra, um, they love beautiful things. They love being surrounded by beautiful things and they try to find the love in everybody that they meet. And their earth element makes them painstakingly realistic and logical. 99.9% um, of their de decisions are based off of logic. The Taurus's fixed earth element really plays a big role when it comes to their tasks or their goals that they have set out for them. When it comes to these things, they're extremely committed and they will not stop unless something tragic happens. No matter what sacrifices they have to make, if it's a goal or task that they set their minds to, they will make sure that it gets done. Most people under the Taurus sign lean more on the conservative side when it comes to uh, decision making. They really like to think things through before they make any rash decisions. Tauruses are extremely great negotiators. When they're placed in an unhealthy situation where it's he said, she said, and it's like a whole argument, they're really good at bringing up realistic and logical solutions uh, to be able to kind of give the whole situation um, an answer rather than just bickering back and forth which is an extremely admirable skill that they have. But Tauruses are extremely dependent on others and it gives them a hard time when they have to make sudden changes because of their fixed element. They need to have enough logical evidence for them to move forward with that decision that you're offering them. So if a Taurus changes something in their lives, it's most likely because they chose to do it and they will keep that in their heads forever. A few other downfalls is that they do hold grudges longer than they should. Um, I'm not saying that they hold grudges for life, but they do harbor hateful feelings towards others longer than they should and they also can be extremely materialistic. And that kind of plays along with self-development too. I'm not saying that all Tauruses are like this. Um, a lot of people are very materialistic and they hold grudges on other people. But the sign that I witness a lot of these things happening the most is the Taurus. All right, moving on to family and friends. So Tauruses are extremely family oriented. They love being around their family when they are available. So Tauruses usually have a very busy schedule. They like to get things done. They like to organize things. And when they set out time to be with their family, it's just a blast. They also value children. So a lot of Tauruses will 
most likely end up having kids or have kids um, whether it be through adoption or uh, creating a kid of their own. And when it comes to friends, Tauruses are an extremely approachable sign. Although they prefer their close-knit group of friends, they also can hang out with a larger group of friends. They can be extremely sociable and relatable. And what I've personally noticed is that Tauruses know how to really pick your funny bone. They uh, can be extremely witty and humorous at times. Um, which is also a good trait, especially in friendship. Moving on to relationships. In relationships, Tauruses do break a lot of hearts, I'm not gonna lie. And their grounded nature really kind of attracts a lot of other people that um, have already invested their time into them. Um, but their grounded, fixed, consistent nature really makes other people admire that about them especially when it comes to partners but sometimes tauruses are too quick to jump into relationships and end up getting themselves into very very sticky situations and if the relationship that they quickly jump into is toxic um they will usually be blinded by the love that the other person is giving to them that no matter what that person says to them or says to the people around them, they will stand by them no matter what. And that is also another trait of the fixed earth sign from them when it comes to relationships. When it comes to loyalty, a Taurus is loyal in a relationship until they feel that they are not getting anything out of it or until they feel that they deserve better they will go out and find somebody else and make their standards higher than you being in the relationship with them. So yes, a Taurus can be extremely loyal if it's with the right person. <laughs> Moving on to careers. Tauruses are extremely committed to their work, um, more than their relationships sometimes, but when it comes to work, and making something for themselves and achieving things for themselves, especially in the workplace, they're committed. Especially when it comes to group settings or group workplace settings where they have to work with other people to solve a problem or to maybe release a project, they are extremely great to work with and they're extremely patient as well. So if you are the type of person to ask a lot of questions like me when you're confused, the best person to go to is a Taurus because they usually have all the answers. And it is no surprise that Tauruses can climb that corporate ladder like it's nothing because of their work ethic rather than their experience. If a Taurus is passionate about something and they get a job for it with no experience, they usually catch on extremely quickly and they will be able to climb the corporate ladder faster than other people because of their commitment and work ethic. And they also love to tap into their creative side and bring new ideas into the work environment for not only their bosses, but their employees, their friends, everybody around them. So a few career paths that a Taurus will most likely gravitate towards can be both creative and helpful towards other people. So career paths along the lines of the arts, financing or banking, project management, as well as planning. A few compatible signs with the Taurus are Cancer, Virgo, Capricorn, Pisces, and Scorpio. Moving on to likes and dislikes. So Tauruses love to be out. They love to do things that make them happy. So whether it be going to the mall, getting their hair done, gardening, um, playing sports, like whatever it is that they like to put their extra time into that's usually what they like they love cooking they love music they love expensive things because of their venus um and they also love working with their hands they love hands-on work they love visual work they do not like sudden changes they don't like uh advice coming from another person to them <laughs> they don't like complications they do not like people who are insecure. Although it will take them a lot to um, really not like a person like that, uh, it usually happens when that insecure person is putting that insecurity on the Taurus themselves. That's when they kind of step back and they're like, no. A few famous celebrities that are in fact Tauruses are David Beckham, The Rock, Adele, and Megan Fox. 
All right, guys, so that concludes my latest Zodiac series video on the Taurus. I hope that this video was helpful for you, and I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And if you have questions or ideas for future uploads, or if you are in fact with the Taurus, or if you are a Taurus, let me know if this resonated in the comments below to be featured in my next video. Thank you guys for watching, and I will go ahead and see you guys next time.